Working out to me means learning to love my body. I used to hate my body because I'm in an Asian body. I have a non-binary body. I have a, I have a queer body. But I'm slowly learning to love these identities, love these parts myself, and slowly unlearning the hate. From cis men, um, I'm actually really passing until they hear my voice. And with cis women, I'm also really passing, but until they see me in the locker room, they have almost like a scare, which I understand, but it does get very frustrating being in this space. I think that learning how to navigate the space is a process that's outside of just working out. I used to be very intimidated in going, and I feel like I've put in a lot of work and energy to navigate the space where I feel like I belong here. I need to come here. This is my time to do something that I want to do for myself because I am in a non-binary body. Masculinity is so fragile. It's so toxic. It's terrible. I hate it. I think being healthy is subordinate to what it means to finally love my body. And that's just a perk of working out. This is something that I, I really learned to value somewhere where I am vulnerable with myself because not only am I learning how to love my body, but learning how my body reacts, learning how my body moves, learning how my body feels. And, and with all that, that's, that's privileged because not everyone gets to be able to do that.